Welcome to episode 45, Dilip Shangri 12 Lessons. This is an outline of episode 45. Lesson number one, strategy, strategy, and strategy. The pharmaceutical industry was dominated by old monopolies. The first thing is strategy. For example, India has no patent, yet he spends heavily on R&D. Was he crazy? No, it was his strategy. Lesson number two, he is a quiet leader who shuns publicity. He doesn't allow photos except business magazines. He doesn't attend TV host shows. He almost does not grant interviews. Lesson number three, vision of a global brand from day one. From day one, he wanted to build a global brand of the highest standard. He named his company Sun Farmer. Sun means unlimited energy, unlimited source. Lesson number four, find a niche. He began with the manufacturing of one psychiatric drug to treat bipolar disorder. Lesson number five, world-class execution, world-class manufacturing. To receive it from our dynamic prime minister is a special feeling. He's seen us grow from a small company to what we are today. And this transformation in Sun's journey to where we have reached has been possible because of our focus on solving problems for patients and making appropriate investments in technology, in world-class manufacturing, and in research and development. Lesson number six, the acquisition king or the takeover king. He had acquired 16 pharmaceutical companies. He practices relentless cost control. Every single one of the 16 acquisitions have been turned around and growing. Lesson number seven, put up a big fight. For example, when he tried to take over a taro farmer, he spent three years of litigation in the Israeli court. Lesson number eight, recurring drug. Zhang Wei thinks the human body is like a car. As the body ages, it requires more treatment and more drugs as well. So he focuses on those drugs that people have to continue taking for a longer period. Lesson number nine, enter a new market, take a loss. For example, his takeover of U.S. drug company Caracol in 1997, so he could enter the U.S. market and learn how to deal with FDA. Lesson number 10, how to avoid disaster. He was able to buy out his competitors because his competitors faced disasters and their stock prices plummeted. His mantra is, Never begin to dig a well when there is fire. Lesson number 11. Hire ordinary people, not genius. He once said, Steve Jobs' philosophy was to hire the best and ensure there's not a B member in your team. I prefer to get the best out of the average people. Lesson number 12. Think ahead of the competition. In 1983, he started Sun Farmer with one employee and $150. In 1984, the Waxman and Hatch Act passed in the United States for generic drugs. Shang Hui set his sight on the lucrative North American generic drug market, which today makes up more than 50% of his sales. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and leave your comments and questions below. Wishing everyone peace and prosperity.